Little pig, little pig, let me in. Pull on this freaking huge hair on my chinny chin chin. What the heck am I looking at? Published by Activision in 1989 for the PC, Commodore 64, and eventually the Sega Genesis, Tongue of the Fat Man looks like an abomination. I am baffled by this cover art. On one hand, hey, I'll admit, it catches my attention, but on the other hand, how the heck is this the best portrayal of the game that Activision could come up with? It says absolutely nothing about the game. And could you possibly come up with a more unattractive part of the body aside from the anus itself? And you know, for a game about a fat man, this is clearly the chin of a skinny person. And I have a pretty strong argument to think that this is a woman's chin as well. The eyes shooting out of the nostrils are a nice touch that I would say nightmare fuel is made out of. And I think right here, I think they may have meant to make somewhat of a Hitler stash, but I, I can help them out there. They messed up a little bit. And there's no tongue. There's no tongue at all to your mom's chagrin. I laugh at the atrocity that is this cover art. And then I see a screenshot from the game like this. Well, the art makes a lot more sense now, I suppose. Take a wild guess on the genre of this game. Just go ahead and take a guess. It is a fighting game. How would you know that? And again, I'm speechless. And you know what? If you don't like this, I got a chin for you. Look at the chin on that. How do you like that chin? Tongue of the Fat Man. Awful box art, even worse game.